Multimillionaire and CEOs of Tesla Elon Musk is a person who's always focused. And this year, it looks like the focus might be on something not very closely related to cars. Now your first guess might be robots. And as a matter of fact, robots it is. But what exactly is he doing? Is he now in favor of AI robots? Stay tuned to the video as we'll talk about the current focus of Elon Musk and what are his plans related to his very new, out of the blue project related to robots. So to know more, stay tuned to the video. Hello and welcome back to the AI universe. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update on the new things we bring for you regarding the tech and the trends but also the vital difference between the haves and the have-nots. That being said, let's begin. Recently, Elon Musk on a call with his investors on Tesla earnings claimed that his nascent robot plans had the potential to be more significant than the vehicle business. They would be the most important things Tesla worked on this year. The robot in question is part of project dubbed Optimus, which was previewed last year to raise eyebrows by a human in a robot suit dancing on stage. And as usual, the performance became an extremely popular meme. Mr. Musk said at the event last August that the Tesla bot, as it was dubbed, would use the same artificial intelligence AI systems that helped power Tesla vehicles, but no prototype has yet been made. He also said that the not yet built 5 feet 8 inch robot would have a screen on its face and be able to lift 150 pounds and travel at about 5 miles per hour. Pretty cool, right? So recently, Mr. Musk told the investors that the humanoid robot's first application would be at a Tesla plant, moving parts around the factory, or something like that. But in the future, he sees it helping solve labor shortages. This in turn can have a lot of pros and cons. And earlier he tweeted, Tesla AI might play a role in AGI, artificial general intelligence, given that it trains against the outside world, especially with the advent of Optimus. AGI refers to the ability of a machine to learn or understand tasks currently performed by humans. Musk has previously warned AI risks, killing off human civilization. And in the same Twitter thread, he added, decentralized control of the robots will be critical. Elon Musk designed a humanoid robot to help with those repetitive, boring tasks people hate doing. Musk suggested it could run to the grocery store for you, but presumably, it would handle any number of tasks involving manual labor. Predictably, social media is filled with references to a string of dystopian sci-fi movies about robots where everything goes wrong. As troubling as the robot futures in movies like iRobot, The Terminator, and others are, it's the underlying technologies of real humanoid robots and the intent behind them that should be cause for concern. Musk's robot is being developed by Tesla. It's a seeming departure from the company's car-making business until you consider that Tesla isn't a typical automotive manufacturer. The so-called Tesla bot is a concept for a sleek, 125-pound human-like robot that will incorporate Tesla's automotive artificial intelligence and autopilot technologies to plan and follow routes, navigate traffic, in this case, pedestrians, and avoid obstacles. Dystopian sci-fi overtones aside, the plan makes sense, albeit within Musk's business strategy. The built environment is made by humans for humans. And as Musk argued at the Tesla bot's announcement, successfully advanced technologies are going to have to learn to navigate it in the same ways people do. Yet Tesla's cars and robots are merely the visible products of a much broader plan aimed at creating a future where advanced technologies liberate humans from our biological roots by blending biology and technology. A researcher who studies the ethical and socially responsible development and use of emerging technologies finds that this plan raises concerns that transcend speculative sci-fi fears of super smart robots. Also, professor of robot ethics Alan Winfield at the University of West England said, AGI is an exceptionally hard problem. Musk does like hard problems though, from autonomous cars to trips to Mars, and has had plenty of successes. SpaceX's reusable rockets are widely regarded as representing a big step forward for space flights, for example. But previous efforts to create cost-effective mass-market humanoid robots have failed. For example, last June, Japanese conglomerate SoftBank announced production of Pepper, a friendly little humanoid, had been paused and would start again only when the robots were needed, much to the dismay of the academic community that used them. But robots are increasingly used in factories around the world, with a current average of 126 robots per 10,000 employees in the manufacturing industry, according to the International Federation of Robotics. But still, 
Researchers remain skeptical about Musk's plans. Excel robotic software engineer Philip Piknewski tweeted, Anyone who thinks Tesla is building a humanoid robot is living in an alternate reality. Mars bases are more likely than the bot. And Professor of Cognitive Robotics Tony Prescott at the University of Sheffield told BBC News that Musk would face many challenges. He said, if it is being used in a factory, then a wheel-based robot would be much easier to build and have no problems of balance, but then it wouldn't be humanoid. But on the other hand, self-driving cars, interplanetary rockets, and brain-machine interfaces are steps toward the future Musk envisions, where technology is humanity's savior. In this future, energy will be cheap, abundant, and sustainable. People will work in harmony with intelligent machines and even merge with them, and humans will become an interplanetary species. It's a future that, judging by Musk's various endeavors, will be built on a set of underlying interconnected technologies that include sensors, actuators, energy and data infrastructures, systems integration, and substantial advances in computer power. Together, these make a formidable toolbox for creating transformative technologies. Musk imagines humans ultimately transcending our evolutionary heritage through technologies that are beyond human or superhuman. But before the technology can become superhuman, it first needs to be human, or at least be designed to thrive in a human-designed world. So eventually this make-tech-more-human approach to innovation is what's underpinning the technologies in Tesla's cars, including the extensive use of optical cameras. These, when connected to an AI brain, are intended to help the vehicles autonomously navigate road systems that are, in Musk's words, designed for biological neural nets with optical imagers, in other words, people. In Musk's telling, it's a small step from human-inspired robots on wheels to human-like robots on legs. For the Tesla bot developers, Tesla's full self-driving technology, which includes the dubiously named autopilot, is the starting point for developing the Tesla bot. Even though this technology is very impressive, it has proven to be less than fully reliable. Tesla has been involved in a series of crashes and fatalities related to its autopilot mode, including the latest incident in which Tesla's algorithms weren't able to detect parked emergency vehicles, which calls into question the wisdom of releasing the tech so soon after its launch. So this track record doesn't bode well for human-like robots that rely on the same technology. Yet this isn't just a case of getting the technology right. Tesla's autopilot glitches are exacerbated by human behavior. For example, some Tesla drivers have treated their tech-enhanced cars as though they are fully autonomous vehicles and failed to pay sufficient attention to driving. Could something similar happen with the Tesla bot? Well, Professor Prescott said that one of the biggest challenges would be keeping the robot upright as well as creating hands and any form of hand-to-eye coordination for the robot. He said, these are fundamental research problems that you need to solve. Tesla cars are robots, but they are a much simpler form. So this will be starting from scratch, Professor Prescott added. Professor Winfield agrees with Musk on one thing though. The only thing that Musk is getting right is that the path towards AGI will be through physical robots, he said. It may disappoint some customers that Tesla's CEO is now focused on robotics. In the same earnings call, he also stated the company would not be introducing any new car models in 2022 and he does have a history of making rather ambitious promises. However, we cannot say that the Tesla bot isn't a good idea, or that Elon Musk shouldn't be able to flex his future building muscles. But if they are used in the right way, these are transformative ideas and technologies that could open up a future full of promise for billions of people. Or maybe this is the abiding lesson from dystopian robot future sci-fi movies that people should be taking away as the Tesla bot moves from idea to reality not the more obvious concerns of creating humanoid robots that run amok, but the far larger challenge of deciding who gets to imagine the future and be a part of building it. But more on that later. That's all for today from our side. If you like the video, then do make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss another video and stay tuned for more of such amazing tech news.